sprung here in the Big Apple, and what better way to celebrate than putting your best face forward. I'm here at Rouge with owner Rebecca. Nice to see you. Hi, nice to see you. Thanks for coming. Thank you for having me. So this is an amazing space. Tell me a little bit about what you're doing here at Rouge. So my background as a makeup artist is in film and television, and so my relationship with my clients, my actors, was always just to make them feel right for the role or feel beautiful, feel ready to be on camera. And my partner, who is one of the actors on, on Law & Order SVU, we met there, um, she and I felt like there wasn't a model for makeup services in the same way that there is for your hands or your hair. Where's the place for your face, we said. So Absolutely. Rouge was born and we are sort of full service for your face from brow waxing to makeup applications. We're here to make you feel ready. So just like you put clothes away mm -hmm. for springtime, mm -hmm. you're gonna do the same with makeup. Mm -hmm. What products should New York women uh, take out for spring and summer and should they put back into the closet for next year? As we get into the summer months, powdery foundations can look a little too, a little too dry, a little too, like, they could turn pasty if you get sweaty, you know, so yeah. let's just get rid of them. One thing to really take out is um, an SPF setting mist. So we have um, a beautiful spray that at the end of the makeup we can spray on top of your skin. It helps set your makeup and it's also a great way to reapply sunscreen throughout the day without messing up your makeup. I'm sure just like New York City that you have many different nationalities mm -hmm. coming in here. Many different ladies, they want to feel beautiful. Mm -hmm. How do you want to provide that for them? What are, you, what are you doing? I think that the key to making a woman feel beautiful is when she feels listened to and then when she likes the results she can feel confident. Rebecca shows me a trendy day look that I can wear to the office. She applies a gel liner and then tops it with the navy shadow and then tints my lips with a blue lipstick. As for Tien, Alden covers her eyes in a light gold shadow and makes her skin look dewy and fresh. Topped off with a pouty pink lip and she's good to go. So looks like I am all finished over here, loving it. And I wanna see how Tien is doing. Tien, you ready for this? Yes, okay. I am ready. Turn it over, girl. Yeah. Don't you look beautiful? Oh my god! I love it. So you look so dewy and fresh. Your skin looks great, and I'm loving. Thank you. The light, the light I love it. Color. I love it, and I love how they apply the blue eyeliner, yeah, and I perfect. love your cheekbone. Like, thank you, darling. <laughs> All right. So now we're gonna. She has a hot date tonight, so we're gonna transition. I am. Yep. We're gonna transition <laughs> the day and tonight because let's face it, no yes. New York girl wants to go home and go redo it again. So okay. back around we go. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> Alden takes Tian's look from day to night with a pair of false lashes. She advises her Asian customers to use individual lashes rather than strips so they look more real. Taking my look from the office to happy hour couldn't be easier. Rebecca applies a pearl blue gloss to my lips and darkens my eyeliner. And there we have it. I feel ready to take on the town now. Yeah. Well, 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 don't you look beautiful? Oh my god, you look so sexy. Thank you, I feel sexy. And your lips look beautiful. And I've noticed that like your cupid's bow is just... That's the trick I learned today. Yeah? For that real? is, yeah, just a little bit of highlighter here. So your lips will look so pouty. They do, and your eyelashes too. I mean, talk about natural. Normally I see the, you know, I see some girls... That's my natural and... eyelashes. Oh, is it now? Yeah, I actually it believe is. you if I didn't know that we were here. <laughs> yeah, and isn't this cool? This this lipstick is actually blue, but it has like a purpley kind of tint, right? Like this taint color, it's so chic right now. Yeah, so it we're on point. Smoking. Are you ready to go take over um, some bars downtown? Of course. Of course. As Rebecca and Alden showed us, spring beauty is all about less is more. Stick with colors that brighten your face, but nothing too far from your skin tone. Take inspiration from the runway and tone it down for everyday wear. It's easy to take a look from day to night. Just add a darker lip or eye. No makeup bag is complete without a made-for-you product. At Rouge, they make their very own lipstick and lip gloss in store. Tian and I chose glittery red lipstick with no pigment with an apple scent. We're calling it Big Apple Red. It's so cool. <gasps> Tian, I am seriously looking forward to putting my best face forward on the town today. How about you? Me too. I'm trying this. Yes. All right. Yes. We're good to go. Reporting from New York, I'm Christy Clavin.